Hello beautiful people, my name is Tolu Lopez Michael. I've been in cyber security now for close to a decade and the past few months I've been doing some research and I'm going to be giving you my 15 predictions for the next decade for technological landscape for the United States of America and also my predictions for Africa. These are all in the area of technology. Number one, quantum computing breakthrough. That's number one. Quantum computing will reach a level of maturity where it becomes commercially viable for solving complex problems in fields like cryptography, drug discovery, and optimization. Number two is artificial general intelligence. Significant progress will be made towards AGI with AI systems demonstrating human-like understanding and reasoning across a broad range of tasks, like above and beyond what we know now. 5G and beyond, the widespread adoption of 5G will be followed by the development and nearly implementation of 6G technology. As a matter of fact, in China, they are already developing 6G as we speak, further increasing the connectivity speeds and enabling new applications in IoT, AR and VR, and then autonomous systems. Number four is autonomous vehicles, self-driving cars, trucks and drones will become commonplace transforming transportation and logistics industry and reducing the need for human drivers number five personalized medicine advances in genomics and biotechnology will lead to highly personalized medical treatment that are tailored to an individual's genetic profile improving the effectiveness of healthcare so your genetic profile will determine what you're going to take and this is going to happen in the next decade number six we're going to have smart cities urban areas will increasingly adopt smart city technologies and these include iot sensors ai driven traffic management like the traffic management as we used to know it is not going to be like that anymore and energy efficient infrastructure that would enhance the quality of life and sustainability number seven is blockchain integration blockchain technology will become an integral part and also integral to various sectors beyond including supply chain management finance and digital identity verification trust me on that number eight is extended reality virtual reality augmented reality and mixed reality will become ubiquitous in entertainment education and even workplace training and creating immersive and interactive experiences trust me on that it's going to be immersive and it's going to be the common thing number nine is space exploration private companies and national space agencies will achieve significant milestones in space exploration including manned missions to mars the establishment of lunar bases and the commercialization of space travel. Number 10 is biometric security. Biometric authentication methods such as facial recognition, voice recognition, and fingerprint scanning will become the standard for securing personal and financial information. Right now, we still use PIN and password. In a decade, that's no longer going to be the case. It's going to be biometric method. Number 11 is sustainable energy solutions. Advances in renewable energy technologies such as solar, wind, and fusion power will drive a global transition towards sustainable energy sources. And this will reduce the global dependence on fossil fuels. Number 12 is Internet of Things. IoT will become deeply integrated into our daily life with smart homes, wearable devices, connected appliances, providing seamless automation and data-driven insight. The things that you need to Google to do a lot to know will become common information. Number 13 is cybersecurity evolution. As cyber threats become more sophisticated, new cybersecurity measures, including AI-driven threat detection and quantum encryption will be developed to protect against increasingly complex attacks. You need to know that with this increase in technology, the rapid increase, there will be increase in cyber threats and cyber attacks as well. So cyber security will become the new baby. Number 14 is biotechnology 
and synthetic biology. Innovations in biotechnology and synthetic biology will lead to breakthroughs in agriculture such as lab-grown meat. If you guys have been hearing about genetically modified crops now, especially in Africa, that will be the normal thing. That will be the new normal. And then sustainable biofuels as well. And number 15 on the global level is human augmentation. Wearable and implementable technologies will enhance human capabilities from exoskeletons that provide physical strength to neural interfaces that enable direct brain-to-computer communication, blurring the lines between humans and machines. Let me ask you, have you heard about Neuralink? If you've heard about Neuralink, go read up about Neuralink. Go read up on what they are doing right now and what they plan to do. These predictions reflect a future that is shaped by rapid technological advancement that will transform various aspects of our life, of our economy, as our and even our finance as we know it. That is for the global landscape. Now, predictions for the United States for the next decade. AI and automation will be the thing. The US will see widespread adoption of AI and automation across various industries, leading to increased productivity, efficiency, and new job opportunities, while also posing challenges that are related to job displacement and workforce retraining. So if I were you, I will learn more about AI and adapt. Number two, cybersecurity leadership. As open threats grow, the US will lead in developing advanced cybersecurity measures, including AI-driven threat detection, quantum encryption, and even robust cybersecurity policies. Some of the cybersecurity policies that we know as of today will be revamped to meet up with the rapidly changing technology. Number three is climate tech innovation. The US will invest heavily in climate technology, focusing on carbon capture, renewable energy, electric vehicles, and sustainable agriculture to combat the climate change that we have to achieve a net zero emissions. Number four is healthcare transformation. You see, advances in personalized medicine, telehealth, and AI-driven healthcare solutions will transform the US healthcare system that will improve patient outcome and also reduce cost. If you guys notice, people are living longer now than before. People are living longer and it's going to continue in that manner. Number five is space exploration and commercialization. The US will continue to lead in space exploration with private companies and NASA achieving significant milestones in lunar emissions, mass exploration and space tourism as well. Number six, 5G and connectivity. The rollout of 5G networks across the country will enhance connectivity and this will enable new applications in IoT. If you don't know what IoT means, it means Internet of Things. You can Google that and read up about that. Also, smart cities and autonomous systems. You can read up on that as well. In the next decade, that will be the next thing. Number seven is smart infrastructure. You see, investment in smart infrastructures, including intelligent transportation system, energy efficient buildings, and resilient grid technologies will modernize the US infrastructure. Trust me on that. And number eight, education technology, popularly known as EdTech. EdTech solutions will become integral to the U.S. education system, providing personalized learning experiences, remote education uh, opportunities, and skills development aligned with future job market. What does that mean? The implication is the education as we know it is no longer going to be the same. As a matter of fact, there are some people that are in the university that would have to drop out thinking to themselves like, why am I here? this does not serve any purpose for me that is my predictions for the united states now let's look at our motherland africa predictions for africa for the next decade leapfrogging in mobile technology africa will continue to lead in mobile technology adoption we are leading now and trust me africa will continue to lead with significant enhancement in mobile banking digital payment and e-commerce platform that's catering to the continent's growing population. If you guys know what is going on in Nigeria now, you will understand, and even Africa at large, you will understand 
that right now we have the highest number of youthful population in any continent so that will continue to power this particular part of the technology and economy number two is renewable energy expansion africa will invest heavily in renewable energy sources such as solar wind and hydroelectric power and this will address the continent energy needs and reduce over dependence on fossil fuels number three is agricultural innovation you guys know i have to add this there as part of my research the adoption of precision agriculture drone technology and genetically modified crops will boost agricultural productivity and food security across the continent as i speak to you now there's a gradual adoption of genetically modified crops in africa and it's going to increase number four tech hubs and startups african cities like lagos nairobi and cape town will emerge as major tech hubs go and write that down fostering a vibrant startup ecosystem and attracting global investment in technology and innovation number five is digital infrastructure development trust me on this trust me on this i know right now it doesn't seem like it but trust me on this significant investment will be made in expanding digital infrastructure including high-speed internet data centers and cloud computing services and this will bridge the digital divide and enabling broader access to technology do you guys know what is going on in nigeria now with starlink and with the minister of you can remember his portfolio basically the minister in charge of technology what he's doing right now that is going to percolate all the way to africa trust me on that infrastructure will be built digital infrastructure number six education and e-learning e-learning platforms and digital education tools will revolutionize access to education providing quality learning opportunities to students across rural and urban areas and the reason is simple there's going to be increase in digital infrastructure and this will help everyone both in the rural and urban part of the continent access to digital education number seven is healthcare innovation mobile health solutions telemedicines and ai driven diagnostics will improve healthcare delivery in africa particularly in remote and underserved regions number eight which is the last one is smart city initiatives several african countries would implement smart city technologies to improve urban living enhance public services and also manage resources efficiently now of all these predictions if i were you i would look at everything that is applicable to me and see how i can key in and enjoy the opportunity that this technology will provide rather than fight it you can't fight this one these are things that will unfold in our eyes in the next 10 years if you've gotten value from this video please like subscribe and share to those who believe will get one or two things from here until the next time i will see you again on the next one bye for now